I made these little charts for my girl. As you can see, I just scribbled them very quickly. They're on little flashcards, actually, that I didn't use anymore. So it's nice cardboard. And they're kind of tall. And then I have this box of little people, which I collected. Little people and all kinds of different types. There's like very simple ones like this. There's other little kind of people. There's even little animals like this, which I used to keep as little sets, but now that they're a little older, we just put them all together and we use this box for all types of things, all types of games. We tell our stories with them. Anyway, for this game is my little girl, she gets to pick one for each chart. Okay, so she has the little dinosaur and she re puts it on the sound. She reads the sound. These are the sounds that she's working through. And then she has to climb up by reading each word till she gets to the top of the flower. So what she has to do is she has to try to get all her little people to the top. So she'll go sh, shall, shop, shag, shell, shack, shock, ship, shut, shin, shell. Oops, I read that one twice. And she makes it to the top. So when she finishes it, once she finishes it, we put it up like this with our little person at the bottom. He won his prize. Then we go for the next one. Here's a very, very tall clown. I started drawing a girl and then I changed it to a clown, as you can see. I didn't really want to make a tall girl. Anyway, she'll pick another little person. Okay, or an animal. She loves her animals. She'll read the sound. Sn snap. Snag. Snack. She'll go all the way. Oh, if she gets one wrong, we go back down the chart. And we'll start again. She gets it wrong, we'll go back down. And she has to make it all the way to the top for her to win the little prize and so it can stand up next to the other one. Then we'll go up the balloon. We'll fly up the balloon with our woof sound. Or we'll climb up the, the ladder with our stuff sound. Climb up the mountain with our spa. We'll go up to the moon with our sluff. We'll go up to the top of the roof, to the house, top of the house, up to the roof with our the. We'll go up the tree with our ch. And we'll go up the dog with our th. And then this last one, which we just did today, these are all these different little pencils she'll get to use and color with them. But these are all her sounds that she's learned so far mixed up. So this was a little bit more tricky and challenging. When she didn't know one up, oh, we just went back again. That way she practices these ones really good again. And she gets to do this one a second time.